name is Mikolaj Przybyła and I'm the brand manager of GL Optic. If you are working with larger products, LED arrays of this size or LED strips like that, then obviously you would need larger integrating spheres because first of all, the physically these um, fixtures would not fit into the small sphere and secondly, the radiant power or the flux emission of these sources are much higher, therefore we are recommending higher, uh, larger integrating spheres. So this is uh, the example of larger integrating sphere. This is a 50 centimeter sphere provided by GL Optic. And in such sphere you can measure uh, retrofit lamps, smaller luminaires and medium size um, LED arrays. So now I'm going to present you our uh, 50 centimeter sphere for radiant power and luminous flux measurement. This sphere can be connected either with a handheld small uh, portable spectrometers from GL Optic or laboratory equipment like Spectis 8. In such sphere we can measure traditional light sources like this or we can measure LED based retrofit lamps, we can also measure medium sized uh, LED arrays as well as small luminaires. So you have to take into consideration the size of the sphere and the recommended uh, size of the sample which can be measured inside such sphere. So this sphere, when I close the sphere and I have my uh, Spectis 8 spectrometer uh, connected to this sphere and also calibrated as a whole setup, this can be measuring uh, radiant power and luminous flux of, of any kind of uh, lighting fixture and we are also calculating in our software uh, critical parameters like color coordinates according to CIE standards, color temperature, color peak, color dominant, purity and other uh, parameters. So this is the setup with 50 cm sphere from GL Optic our Spectis 8 spectroradiometer laboratory grade equipment as well as the software interface which is allowing you to perform uh, detailed spectral analysis. There are also other integrating spheres of, available from GL Optic in other si sizes and I will be uh, glad to present you with these other sizes of the spheres later on. For more information you can visit our website www.gloptic.com